you'd probably be asking me questions about what I'm thinking about, I'm not, what I'm looking at, everything, but with like a, a almost like a blur. Uh, it's not precise looking, it's more holistic. I'm kind of taking in with my peripheral vision everything that's floating around out here. Once I get these elements to a place that makes me happy, I'm going to remove them all and start using acrylics onto the clay board so that there's an underlayment to these collaged on pieces. I think the most important thing is being present with a piece of art. Um, if you have a preconceived idea about what this is going to be and where it's going to go, you can short circuit yourself. I think a lot of making art has to be being present with what is unfolding, whether you like it or not, and trying to go with it as it unfolds. I know what this guy needs. Belly button. All right, that at least I can get down and be happy about. Small children, when they're making art, one of the first things they put in are navels. Another thing that tends to make its way into my work for whatever reason is hats. I'm always wearing scarves and hats of all sorts, berets, and inevitably, and this guy's bareheaded, which is incredibly unusual. So I'm about to find something that I can put on top of his head. I'm going to go back to this original piece of paper, and I think I need to put the lid on my my palette. Now that'll stay nice and dry. Yep. So this isn't a calculated move. Hat showed up a long time ago and has stayed. I'd love to tell you I knew it was going to happen next, but I don't know. A bit better. I think it needs to be darker though. So, Better. 